company is getting some national recognition. JCP Construction won the bid to be the general contractor for the upcoming Democratic National Convention. Our Amy DuPont sat down with its owners to learn more about what JCP will be responsible for and how its work is going to benefit the city. Forget about sibling rivalry. The Phelps brothers will tell you the key to success is family. It's uh, kind of amazing looking back and just seeing the growth that we've done. James, Jalen, and Clifton Phelps took a risk together, leaving their full-time jobs in 2009 during the recession to run their own construction company. Yeah, risky move that paid off. Over the last 10 years, JCP Construction has grown from three employees to dozens, working on countless commercial and residential projects, including Pfizer Forum. But their upcoming contract will be their biggest yet. It's a national project, put on the, putting us on the national screen. JCP has been named construction general contractor for the 20 20 Democratic National Convention. Most people drive past our projects and never go on a chance to get inside of them, but people on the national stage will be able to uh, see how we took apart, broke down, put back together the arena in such a short period of time. The transformation from basketball court to convention hall will take place in just two weeks. It's nonstop. To meet its deadline, JCP will hire roughly 30 additional employees permanent positions the Phelps brothers are proud to say pay a family sustainable wage. They can actually save on or save up for owning a house. They can send their kids to college. They can not just think about this generation, but the next generation. A dream got JCP construction off the ground. Determination and family launched it from a kitchen table to the national stage. JCP will start the hiring process soon. They are looking for union journeymen mostly from the Milwaukee area. Live in the newsroom, Amy DuPont, Fox 6 News. A lot of people getting those resumes ready yeah. right now. Amy, thanks. <laughs>